Channel 2 is the station on your side, and tonight we found out that a man from Fredonia who asked us to find out why he's been getting tickets from New York City is part of a bigger problem. In fact, according to the New York State DMV, there are other people in the same spot. And tonight, 2 on your side's Rob Hackford explains why. The first one, I, I, I giggled. I thought I was, I was just like, this is, maybe they just got a number mixed up. When Jason Remington surrendered his license plate to the DMV after selling his car back in January, he thought it would have been the last time he saw K2U6972. But that changed last week. I didn't think anything of it until, as of Friday, I received a ticket in the mail from the New York City Department of Finance. The ticket was for speeding in a school zone down in Queens. A 38 and a 25. The car wasn't Remington's, but the license plate was the same sequence he gave up months ago. Not a day later, he got another ticket, this time for parking at a bus lane down in New York City. And once again... It confused me. I didn't recognize the plate. I definitely didn't recognize the car I was on. But K2U6972 kept coming back. In fact, he found two more tickets from back in May after contacting New York City to challenge the two $65 fines. I mean, I've never been within, 500, within five hours of New York City, so it's definitely not me. And even the DMV confirmed that his plate was destroyed. Four tickets in just a couple months. I mean, whoever's got this plate or wherever this plate is located, somebody's causing some issues, it sounds like. Correct. Absolutely. I mean, it's, I mean, it's stressing me out over the last few days. Um, you know, I just, I don't know what to do. Two on your side contacted the DMV on Remington's behalf. And while they don't handle ticketing or billing done by New York City, the director of public information said in an email that Remington isn't alone. In fact, the DMV has received multiple complaints about tickets issued in the Big Apple using outdated registration info. Quote, the DMV has repeatedly brought customer complaints to New York City's attention after being made aware of this situation. As a courtesy to the customer, the DMV will provide a registration abstract as proof that Mr. Remington did not own the plates in question at the time the violations had occurred. I mean, if it happened to me, I mean, I, I would imagine it could happen to anybody. Remington will continue disputing the tickets, but wants to make sure it doesn't happen again. We did hear from the New York City Department of Finance, and their director of public information said in an email they will investigate. Yeah, of course, we plan to follow up with the New York City Department of Finance, but if you've had this same issue, feel free to contact our newsroom. We can look into it for you. And again, outdated information at the root of this cause. On your side in the studio, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.